Hey guys and welcome back to another video. So in this video what I want to do is I want to tell you guys what I will be doing this winter to make sure that my hair is protected, that it is still growing while it is protected, and that it grows healthier, stronger, and longer this winter and 2017. So stay tuned. So one of the main things that I really want to do this winter, which I have not been doing, is I want to be consistent with my regimen. Now I did do a regimen video a couple of videos back, so you can check out the full regimen, my wash, how I uh, more moisturize my hair and all of that good stuff you can go check out that video but I will be actually doing the exact same regimen except I will be doing it more on a weekly basis so one of the reasons for that is because as it has gotten to the winter months I have found that my scalp is a lot more dry it's a lot more itchy I'm just not really feeling that it is keeping its moisture like it does in the summer and in the spring so what I'll be doing this winter is I'll be trying to be doing more weekly washes I will be doing water washing only throughout the week just to make sure that my scalp is getting water that I am washing away any flakes or dandruff. Now one of the reasons I feel like personally I fell off is because I found something out about my hair and my hair growth and it was just devastating and I just I just for a few months I just didn't really want to pay attention to my hair and I just literally kept it like this and just left it alone but what I want to do is I want to explain exactly what happened and there's actually two very different stories of what has been going on with me but just giving you all a caution is that I do not have alopecia there's no ball spots or anything like that but there is some thing that I should tell you and I will in full detail in an upcoming video so please if you have not subscribed to this channel subscribe so that you will be filled in on everything that's been going on with me and my hair but one of the main things that I want to share with you in 2017 and beyond is that if you do have a setback or you do have a natural hair issue you've been growing your hair it's been flourishing and something happens how you can overcome that and what steps you can do to make sure that you are not getting super depressed super stressed out you know and just giving up on the journey altogether so one of the second things that I really want to do this winter which I've been slightly lacking on is I really want to make sure that I'm keeping my ends moisturized when it is not wash day. So what I'll usually do throughout the week is I will water wash my hair. I, I love going in the shower and just having the water pour on my scalp and on my hair. It's just a wonderful feeling. It's so relaxing. But when I come out, what I usually do is wrap up my hair with a towel and I leave it alone and I do not um, put any moisturizer on the end. So that is something that I really want to make sure that I'm doing is after I water wash my hair, after I get it wet, after I even use my spritz, that I am putting on some of the moisturizer on my hair. So for those of you who asked, I do use my whipped moisture. You can find it on my website. But for those of you who already have like a regimen in place and it's working for you, do what's working for you. So another thing that I really want to make sure that I'm doing this winter is that I am keeping my hair in a protective style longer. So one thing that I've already spoken to you guys about is that I do have a video coming explaining a little bit of some changes that happened with my hair and certain things like that. But because of the changes, I can no longer wear twists. I find that when I put my hair in twists, it is getting really matted at the root. It's, it's, it's literally like if I keep my hair in twists for a week, it will start to dread on me. Like I will literally have to be picking out locks throughout the week and there is a reason for that and hopefully the reason can help any of you who've noticed that you could do something in the past and you can't do it now. Trust me, stay tuned to my next video. You're really gonna wanna hear what I have to say. But because I cannot put my hair in twists for longer than a week, what I'll be doing is keeping my hair in braids. I'm using my natural hair only, so I will not be using synthetic hair or human hair or anything like that. It will be my hair in braids. So instead of wearing it in twists, I'll be wearing it in braids. And I will be trying to keep it in braids for at least two to three weeks. And I really think that that's really going to help my hair flourish and thrive throughout the winter. Make sure that you um, stay connected with me on Facebook and Instagram because I will be posting more pictures this year, which I have not done last year. But this year, I will be more diligent to do that. So for those of you who have not liked my Facebook page, please go like my Facebook page and stay connected with me 2017 on there. And for those of you who have not liked my Instagram, please follow me on Instagram because there's going to be a lot of information I'll be sharing with you throughout the year. Besides that, I hope you guys had a Merry Christmas. Thank you for watching another one of my videos. Don't be a stranger. Let's stay connected and I will see you soon. Bye guys.